everyone, it's Nicole, welcome back to my channel. This week I'm talking about palette knives and I'm going to be sharing the process I use to make this painting, this acrylic painting. Um, first of all, palette knives are really versatile. Uh, they're usually used to mix paints and I must admit I use them mostly for that reason. But, uh, you know, when you're using, particularly on canvas, but they can be used instead of a brush to apply acry acrylic and oil paint. They can also be used to scrape paint off of a canvas. So, unlike buttering bread, more like spreading frosting on a cake <laughs> gives you some kind of idea of the textural options when you use a palette knife to create a painting. So if you're looking to add depth to your paintings, palette knives can provide a really different painting style. Textured layers can be added and or taken away to create a unique painting or change its look. So this is a, a, an abstract painting that I did some time ago. Uh, I'll just talk you through it. Um, yeah, most of it, in fact, the majority of it is done with, with I think this was the one I used mostly. Um, by the way, these only cost a few, few pounds, of th I think three pounds for the pack of three in Wilco, in a, uh, one of the stores in, in, uh, in the UK. So they're not expensive and they, they, keep, they, they keep forever. I mean, they're, they're easy to keep clean. Um, so back to the painting. Uh, yeah, so I used the palette knife, that one, uh, most of all. I did actually use, you can see there are some brush strokes at the edge there. And this is my favourite section of the painting. Um, although it hasn't, it hasn't got that depth. I quite like the fact that there's a contrast there. Um, yeah, I'm going to give you a close-up now of the painting from the top to bottom. Yep. Uh, yeah, I do, I do like the pinky and the yellow uh, and then this, the contrasting darker colours of green, greeny blue. And my favourite part of all was when I did the splash paint. I'll give you even more close up. Splash paint is a really lovely way to sort of finish the painting in my view. And uh, it's a little bit like the child in me comes out there. And you can just really have some fun in that process. And, and, I, and I really did have some fun. So I did this actual painting on a canvas board. Um, on the back here, I'll show you the uh, Make Arteza 8x10. Oh, it's a canvas panel, to be honest. I didn't realise. Canvas panel, yeah, because they're quite thin. Um, but yeah, this is me just sharing the process of this painting that I did. I'm still not absolutely sure whether or not to. it should, you know, be displayed in a landscape or portrait style what do you all guys what do you guys think i'm open to persuasion and it's untitled at the moment so again i'm i'm quite happy for someone to come along and say oh what, it, what you know what it impresses upon um is this or or you know and yeah or it just or it can stay without a title i'm, I'm really you know i'm quite happy for that uh, to happen so that's it for now do let me know in the comment section what you think about this painting and do have a go at palette knives they are really quite fun to use and you get such an interesting style of painting um, it's worth it's worth having a go and practicing all right so that's it for now stay safe and uh, yeah take care bye for now